Just about a year has passed and still the Orange County Sheriff's Office Deputies Association is operating under an expired contract. The lead negotiator tells us those talks began last summer, ended with an impasse and a lawsuit filed by the county. KFTM's Justin Hinton reached out to both parties in the suit. He joins us in the studio with what's going to happen next. Justin? Well, Kelly, they will hash it out in court tomorrow. And at this point, the lead negotiator for the sheriff's deputy says he's made an offer to the county judge and would sign it tomorrow if the county would agree to it. Now, the biggest compromises in that offer include no pay raises from now until fiscal year 2015. Also, deputies would increase their contributions to dependent coverage and health care from 40 percent to 60 percent. That works out to an average to on average about a six to eight percent cut. The lead negotiator for the Deputies Association said the reason they reached an impasse is because the county wanted them to take more of a pay cut. He says while the deputies were willing to take 6 to 8 percent, the county wanted 11 percent. They reached a stalemate. The negotiator says the deputies asked for a third party to come in and that's when the county sued. According to court documents, over good faith bargaining and the impasse the association requested. We reached out to the county judge, the lawyers representing the county who are based out of the Dallas-Fort Worth area, as well as the county commissioners. Commissioner Jody Crump had this to say, quote, It's been almost a year that the sheriff's office has worked outside of the contract dates. I'm ready for the county and bargaining unit to come together and draw a line in the sand so we can move forward. A hearing is scheduled to take place tomorrow in the 128th District Court beginning at 2 p.m. Kelly?